Route 8 in Macedonia is up and running tonight. Despite a few lane closures after that deadly crash nine days ago, you're looking at a live picture of 271 in Route 8. Not a video of the aftermath of a tanker truck going over a bridge seriously impacted roads and area businesses. Our Kaitor K has an update from ODOT on repairs and cleanup. Traffic is flowing again on State Route 8 off of Interstate 271 in Macedonia. On January 27th, a tanker truck with 7,500 gallons of diesel fuel went off the I-271 bridge onto State Route 8, bursting into flames and killing the truck driver. The Ohio Department of Transportation opened up State Route 8 southbound between Highland and Hine Hills Road on Sunday, which was a huge relief to Whistle Express Car Wash nearby, who told us sales were down 90% due to the road closure. Uh, we're back up to our normal flow, um, and we've also been getting some new customers as well. So opening the lanes up out here and getting rid of the orange cones and barrels and everything has tremendously helped. So things are, things are back to normal. Meanwhile, ODOT's District 4 spokesman Justin Chesnick is reporting back with initial inspection results at the crash site. Thankfully, no structural damage. Where we're at is it was cosmetic. We had like soot on the bridges and, and some smoke and things like that that kind of turned those structures black. So they have to clean those structures off. ODOT tells us the Ohio EPA is still cleaning up diesel fuel that ran into Brandywine Creek. A week ago, a civil engineer told 3 News that guardrails or a lower speed limit could keep an accident like this one from happening again. We put those solutions forward to ODOT. Chesnick said they'll consider them after the Summit County Sheriff's Office has finished investigating why the crash happened. Right now, both I-271 ramps are reduced to one lane. ODOT expects it to be another three weeks before they're fully back open. Russ. Okay, Kite OK, thank you. And ODOT is asking for public input from drivers who travel on Route 8. Just before the Central Interchange in Akron. It's hosting an open house on March 5th in the downtown branch of the Akron Summit County Public Library. There, ODOT will lay out plans for a new traffic design that would create an additional travel lane, get rid of a pair of bridges, and create a new underpass. ODOT is also seeking funding for that project. So, a timeline for construction has yet to be announced.